Am I the arsehole? For being jealous of my brother with cancer. I F18 have a brother M26 who has terminal cancer. Ever since he got sick, my family has given me less attention which is understandable. But now it feels like it's to the point where they don't care about me as much anymore. We have a family group chat, on my birthday everybody asked how he was doing instead of wishing me a happy birthday. My parents watch movies with him and spend time with him and never invite me. A few days ago I got frustrated by the fact that I am feeling so left out and ignored that I told my mom about it. I told her I was feeling like a glass child. She called me disgusting and couldn't believe that I was jealous of my brother with cancer. So, I to edit. For clarification, I'm not jealous that my brother has cancer. To be honest I'm not jealous at all I simply used that word because it's the word my mom used to describe me. I spend time with my brother. We recently went on an overseas trip just the two of us together. What I'm upset about is that my family doesn't put much of an effort to check in on me or spend time with me. I understand that he has a limited time left and that they want to continue to spend time with him before he's gone but still, don't I deserve love too? Not the asshole it's okay for you to hold two truths at once, you're very sad scared that your brother has cancer, you're very sad that everyone forgot your milestone birthday and are excluding you from the family events. Usually I'd not say anything bad about a mother dealing with her child having cancer but her reaction to you was the only disgusting that I read here today. Not the asshole. I volunteer with an organization that serves medically vulnerable children, and one of our services is literally giving time and attention to siblings of sick kids. You're allowed to feel hurt and left out, especially since you've mentioned you hang out with your brother it's not like you're bitterly ignoring him. Your family can pour their love and support and energy in your brother without neglecting your feelings. Stay strong. Not the asshole. From what you say, all their attention is focused on him and they don't realize how out in the cold they've left you, even after you've tried to talk to them about it. Your feelings are not disgusting, you are feeling like you're losing your parents on top of the tremendous pain of losing your brother soon. I hope there is a way you can make them see what they're doing, that you need them too. You all need each other right now. I'm really sorry you're going through this but you are definitely not the asshole here. At first, I thought for sure you were going to be the R here but definitely not. Your family didn't even wish you a happy birthday. I would be upset about that too. It doesn't even have to do with your brother or his cancer, it has to do with the rest of your family not making you feel important and you expressing that to your mom is valid. She sounds toxic and gaslighty as f. I'm sorry. Also, happy birthday. Not the asshole. It is 100 okay for you to feel neglected because everyone focuses so much on your bro. They didn't even invite you along to watch a movie on your birthday. There should be groups for teenagers that are dealing with cancer in a loved one. I would seek that out. These are valid feelings but if it's a terminal diagnosis your parents are blinded by the fear that any moment he could be gone. It's not right to treat you like that but that fear of a child dying can be paralyzing. Info how long has it been since he was diagnosed and was his diagnosis revealed on near your birthday or something? I am failing to understand why all your family would suddenly be asking him if he was okay on your birthday unless it was a fresh diagnosis. Nata, just because someone else is dying it doesn't mean you should be emotionally neglected. All they will achieve is make you be resentful. So sorry your family isn't present for you. Not the asshole. It is understandable that he is getting more of their attention, but if they can't even acknowledge your birthday that is too far gone. Not the asshole for wanting to be treated like their daughter. Not the asshole and happy birthday. Not the asshole, your family is neglecting you, and when you point it out, they call you disgusting. That's way over the top. Everyone is stressed and coping with death but that doesn't mean ignore everything else. It's a tough situation. 
it is understandable that you feel neglected in this situation that is unfair for all parties involved. You are in a position where you can exert your independence. You are at an age of getting ready for college. Let them soak up what memories they can make with your brother as you spread your wings. Since they neglected to say it to you happy birthday. Not the asshole you are still a member of your family and deserve to be treated as such. Info PLS if you don't mind to share, no worries if not. I was just wondering how long he's been sick for? Is this a cancer that was picked up some time ago and has got worse over the years? Or is it more recent than that? Not the asshole unfortunately they are losing two children. Don't know if R is the right word. You are still basically a kid whose family is going through tragedy. Be kind and patient with each other. Not the asshole. The movie Sixteen Candles is about a family forgetting their daughter's 16th birthday because of their older daughter's wedding. Not the same as cancer but it's definitely a theme. Not the asshole you are not jealous of your brother's illness. You are a neglected child. I understand your parents feel like spending extra time with their terminally ill child, but you should feel just as loved and important. It sounds like they are completely ignoring you, which is horrible. You talked to your mom about your feelings, which was good. Sadly, she used that conversation to downgrade your feelings and emotions and make you feel worse for having them. Shame on her. Not the asshole. Unless your brother is going to pass imminently your mother's response was awful. I'm shocked your mother could not have at least had some minor apology for forgetting your birthday and given you a hug. That's really all she needed to do and then get back to focusing on your brother. As a cancer survivor having a distraction like a sibling's BD would actually be a relief to not focus on being sick 24-7. Op, I'm so sorry for you and your family. Sending you a virtual hug and belated happy birthday, birthday cake, present. Not the asshole as someone with cancer, I would feel so horrifically guilty if people didn't pay attention to my sister, especially on her birthday. I personally don't want any extra attention, I just want everyone to treat me normally. Otherwise it feels like a constant reminder that I'm ill. You are absolutely not TA for wanting people to wish you a happy birthday, or wanting to be included in movie nights. And I'm so sorry that this has happened to your family 3. Not the asshole. Why wouldn't they invite you to also spend time with your terminally ill brother? I'd want memories with my whole family if someone was about to pass. Not the asshole. You aren't jealous of your brother. You are struggling with your needs going unmet. This is such a common thing that there are support groups that exist for siblings of people with chronic illnesses to help. It happens all too often that a sick child will get all the attention and love because they might not be here soon. Any other children will usually feel neglected, with good reason and the end result is usually that the parents have no children left that wish to talk to them. Not the asshole. It's tragic that your brother is so young and dying of cancer. But that doesn't mean you stop existing and needing love and attention, too, in the interim. I think your mother doesn't realize she may lose both of you if she continues to not acknowledge this and see you.